Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to Zombie Girl Eats. If you are not a part of the Zombie Bam Bam, please make sure you hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, and always leave me a comment down below. And today we're going to be having noodles, shrimp, an egg, and some cucumber, fried egg and some cucumber and then it's also got these little drinks over in my Asian section uh, at work but this one is called milk milkies refreshing milk and yogurt flavor original oh god so that's that one and I got them last night so they're cold this one I absolutely love this is that like lychee fruit I think yeah lychee fruit lychee fruit and so it's cold and in the refrigerator so I'm gonna be trying out these drinks I've had this one before I just haven't had this one before so I don't know then I got me some chopsticks to eat with guys and these are from my local store, so they are disposable. Nothing fancy. Uh, make sure I don't eat no splinters. And then we got my shrimp. I'm not the best with chopsticks. I am still learning, so please don't judge me. Anyways, look at that shrimp, guys. Fried it up in a skillet with some salzone, some lemon juice, a little bit of olive oil. I did put a little bit of obey in it, I ain't gonna lie to you. And then I got me some fried egg. And these are the noodles I'm eating. It is ramen. I kind of butchered the packaging. But I tried these out one time and I've seen a lot of other mukbangers actually eat with them. And so I tried them and they were absolutely delicious. So I've been buying them ever since. So these are the noodles that that I'm actually going to be eating now it comes with like uh, a powder and then like a fried onion to go in it and then like some oil some hot sauce and some I, th I want to say it might be like um, poison sauce I want to say that might be it I'm not sure anyways let's get to grabbing because Lord have mercy I'm starving I'm starving Marvin Let's see. Oh, look at that. Mmm. 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 These are really good, but I should have maybe left a little bit of water because they're kind of dry. Not like a real dry noodle. It's still good. Mm. I went and did this to my wall, hoping that it would be pretty. And now it's backwards. So I'm going to have to put it backwards on my wall. For it to look right for you guys. And then buy the egg. Mmm. Mmm. Oh. I've never had egg and cucumber before. Mm. I almost need cucumber. Mm. And you know what, guys? I'm a big girl. I'm still really new to all this. I don't know. Maybe you guys want to get to know me a little bit. A little bit of what I'm about. Right now, I'm a working mom. Two boys. Happily married for 23 years. 
We met when I was 18 and we've been together ever since. You do the math and then you can find out how old I am. And um, I, I don't want to say love at first sight because he blew me off when we first met. I had a friend that I went to high school with and we reconnected after I turned 18 because we got into some trouble when we were teenagers. I don't know, that might be a whole nother story, but we got into some trouble, not major trouble, but we used to sneak out of my house when she'd come spend the night with me. And anyways, so, you know, after I turned 18, you know, me and her reconnected and I was over at her house one day and her husband comes, you know, driving up and, you know, I see this guy get out of the car and I'm like, hello, who is that? And she was like, oh, that's just, her husband's name was Mikey. She said, oh, that's just Mikey's brother. You wouldn't want anything to do with him. And I was like, hmm, really? He's my type. He's got long hair. I love long hair on man. Mm. Mm. I love long hair on a man. Mm. Let's try this drink, guys. Is it weird that I wanted to smell it first? Ooh, that's good. It's carbonated, but it don't taste like milk, and I don't know, it don't taste like yogurt either. Maybe not American yogurt. Mmm, really good cold. Oh, that is so good. Milkies, I got it in my Asian section of my grocery store. I know, my nails are jacked up, guys. I'm sorry. Okay, back to my little store time. Okay. So, you know, he pulled in or whatever, and, you know, she told me, she was like, you know, that's just his brother. You wouldn't want to do anything to do with him. I was like, hmm, okay. Mm. Oh, my God, that is so good. So, he come into the house. You know, we cooked dinner, we ate, chit-chatted, you know, whatever. And so they were going to take him home because he didn't have a car at the time. He was a few years older than me, but he didn't have a car at the time. And I told her, I said, well, give him my number and tell him to call me. You know, I was 18 years old. Still, you know, of course, living with my mom and my dad. I was really shy in high school, to believe it or not. And she said, okay, she would. So, you know, I took a lot of courage to do what I did. You know, say, hey, tell him to call me. And um, they come back from, you know, dropping him off at home. And I was like, what do he say? What do he say? She was like, girl, he said he wasn't looking for no relationship. I was like, what? I didn't ask him to marry me. All I said was call me. And I was like, really? Okay, whatever. So, you know, I didn't really think anything else about it, to be honest with you. Not a thing about it. Went on about my business. You know, hanging out with her. Uh, I did notice, though, every time I went over there on the weekends, because I was working at this time, too, when I was 18. And, um... I would notice he would show up over there on the on the weekends that I would spend the night because I had like a Monday through Friday kind of job. And uh, he was showing up over there. You know, imagine that. And um, I'm so glad. Well, you're looking good, guys. So. One day out of the blue, he finally did call me. 
my mom coming to the phone. My mom phone does. Back before cell phones become so popular. And um, I got on the phone. I was like, hello. He's like, hey. And I was like, who is this? And he said, Grant. I said, oh. And to be honest with you, from that moment on, we have been together ever since. I went to his apartment, went hang out. Three months later, this all happened in February of 96. By June of 96, I was moved in with him. My mom was so sad. I'm a mama's girl. Mm. 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 I need a child trying to chop the fence. So we moved in together. I moved in with him. I would say by, I don't know, Christmas of that year. Well, no, before that, June, I'd say by probably September or October, he asked me to marry him. That March of 97, we were shy of being together one year when we got married. Twenty three years later. We're still here. Still together. We are definitely each other's rod or die. Out of twenty three years you're old. You go through a lot with each other. Good and bad. Two kids. You know. It took us a while to have the kids. So we were married 13 years before we had our first one. I had a lot of, uh, I was diagnosed at 16 with PCOS which is polycystic ovarian syndrome. And um, so that hindered all that baby making. So, you know, we had fun. We'd go out. We'd be adventurous. Mm. We would definitely be adventurous. Go to clubs. You know, I love karaoke. So he'd go like to the little redneck bars with me. There's a bar we went to one time called Booze and Tunes. Well, if that don't sound country and redneck, I don't know what does. But they had karaoke every Friday, Saturday night. So I'd go, you know, a bunch of my other friends. I'd love to do karaoke too. Because I'm in the South. I'm from Tennessee. Born and raised country girl. Ooh. I don't know if you guys are familiar with like Dolly Parton. I'm sure she's like, well, here she's like a household name. But, you know, I live 45 minutes from Sevierville, you know, Dolly Parton's home. Where she grew up, where she's got her theme park, she's got a water park, 
So, you know, I'm just a straight up country girl. Country city girl, let me put it to you like, because I don't live in the country. I live in the city. But still, I'm, y'all know you can tell I'm a country. Mmm. Been here my whole life. Mmm. Man, them noodles are so good. They're like, I'm gonna say, okay, sorry guys, I'm back. Lord, I done lost train of thought of what I was saying. Comment down below and remind me what I was saying a minute ago. Mmm. Mmm. Mm -hmm. I need some shrimp I had up in my freezer. Left over from when I did my seafood bowl. And you know, I've got so many zombie fam bam out there now. I love you guys to death. I really do. You just don't know how happy that makes me. I love filming. I love eating. Mm. I do. I love eating. I watch some other channels. One's called Natural Life. On YouTube, it's like these um, women from Thailand that it's like cooking, they cook. And I watch them score cucumbers to put cute little shapes. I don't think I did it right. It's kind of got a shape, but kind of not. Yeah, I don't think I did it right. Mmm, mm, let's try this one. Like I said, I've had this one before, but that's good. I like it. Oh. Mmm. Leche. Make sure you get it cold, too. It is really good cold. Mmm. And I absolutely love messaging all my subscribers. And when my subscribers message me, and the people that I sub to, I love watching your guys' videos. Absolutely love watching your guys' videos. Electric like the French Mmm. 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 I love him and he loves me. We always tease each other and say, you know, we're, we're together for life, if not after. Because I can handle your crazy and you can handle my crazy. Mmm. 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 I'm getting full. I actually made three packs of noodles. 
a whole cucumber. Let me set this up. Mm. I'll probably honest with you guys anyways. I do live in an apartment. You may hear my neighbors. Mm. Uh oh. Uh oh. Little foul. Mm -hmm. That's my husband in the back here, man. I'm trying to record. Didn't know he's still laughing. Mm. That's so good. Mm. Well, girl is getting for him. I need the sushi. I love missing sushi. Mm. 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 I feel a little bit like me. I'm not little. Mm. Mm. There's gonna be more time. Fun. Story times. Maybe you're queuing in. You guys can ask me some questions you may want to know. Mmm. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. I'm gonna take another drink of that. That was good. Ah, that is really good. Mmm. Guys, I think I'm gonna wrap it up today. If you have not already subscribed, if you're new to my channel, Please, oh, please think about subscribing. And to all my zombie fam bam out there, thank you so much for your love and support. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and you hit that notification bell to get notified every time I upload a brand new video. Comment down below. I mean, I absolutely love hearing from you guys. I love it when you comment down below and I can actually interact with you guys. So if you want a Q&A, comment down below. Let me know, you know, something you may want to ask me. <clears throat> Excuse me. That's so good. And you know what? Much love to you guys. All my love, support. Uh, until next time, it's Zombie Girl Eats, guys. Bye. Tell me how to use these. Behind the scenes, guys, when I'm finished and there's leftover food, <laughs> the fam bam comes in and how do you use away. how do you use Bye. Socks?